Oh my god, that's so many zombies. Walk through the traps. And watch that guy. They get bad thoughts from seeing corpses. I mean, they're not there long, but then the bad thoughts linger for a little bit. Look how much damage we're doing to the goddamn walls, too. Alright. Everything's okay. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Attracted the noise they're shooting? That's possible, too. What I'm thinking is we probably need to worry about trying to, like, break more line of sight, actually. Uh, can you walk through graves? I don't know. I do like, a little bit more like this. And I'm actually wondering if we shouldn't do something like that. The zombies might try to bash through these doors if they see aggro, but, like, we might actually just try to minimize some of the angles that these zombies can see us from. Even if it's not completely enclosed. Just doing that construction is going to be hard as hell, though. Um, could you prioritize, like, making the goddamn bed? Oh, we got a raid! I predict Luca's going to die from zombies. Although there's no more zombies left down here. They've all wandered into the middle of the map. Bring up construction in the queue. Because we still have the, uh, the heat wave, which is going to kill everyone here. Yeah, minor heat stroke already. Um, I need you to prioritize doing the, the power conduits there. Oh! The repair is part of construct now. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Wake up. Wake up. Do some goddamn construction here. Um, and don't actually do this. Because I'm really worried that you're going to spend all your time doing this instead of actually hooking up your cooler so you don't fucking die. Pirates are beginning their assault. Yeah, I'm really not worried. <laughs> yeah, go and, go and melee some zombies. You go, man. This is what we need turrets for. Uh, we are going to... What's a deconstruct for these guys? X. X and X. I'm missing a bed right now, but we're going to get another one soon. Uh, so it's Kravek. No. Sorry, I thought we had lovers. Where did my lover Kravek? Uh, where do you get the relationships? Also, why is everything, like, blinking? But Ashi and Kravik must be lovers, right? Might want to restart. Needs tabs. Oops. Yeah, something's definitely bugging out. Some some sort of conflict. Too many mods. Is this thing uh, ready to be harvested? Yeah. Alright, this room, 35. Still insanely hot. It's a big room to try to keep cool. But at least the cooler is working. It might not be insta-death anymore. Major break risk. Why is it always Nero? Awful barracks. The barracks are gone. You're going to be fine. We, you have your own bedroom now that you can share with your lover. You're going to be okay. That actually will be a good moodlet. So the ground slipped in the heat. Uncomfortable. Eight without table. That might be the next thing we want to do, actually, is, even though it doesn't seem like a priority, <laughs> let's get ourselves a little dining room table stuffed in the corner there. You're going to collect the heel root. Excellent. You're going to go to bed. I mean, your bedroom's kind of crap, but it's not going to be as bad as the last room. Very hot. Jesus. Oh, and the cooler broke down because the game hates me. Of course it did. Kravik, could you go and uh, fix the cooler right away? Thanks. You're a peach. 
caravan is arriving. Um, that's gonna be an interesting development. The zombies are trying to chase them. They're just gonna drag zombies to our base. That's what's gonna happen. Set the cooler lower, it'll work better. What? No. That's not the more it works. It just tries... If it's the temperatures above this, it works as strong as possible. It's set to 21. We're down to 24 degrees over here. It's gonna be fine. A free loot on the floor. You're right. That probably is how what is going to happen here. Everyone's going to hate me because a bunch of them are going to get killed by zombies. Although these these packs are pretty powerful, there's actually a good chance that if they start aggroing, although who knows, maybe they'll just aggro on my my whole group. But we might be left with a bunch of kid on the floor. I get a little bit of damage, but I mean the zombies individually are not that hard. So. You guys are happy that you're sharing, getting some loving. All right, good, excellent. Opinion, my lover. So your mood's gonna be a lot better. Nero's still not gonna be super pleased. You're in moderate amount of pain. You're in serious heat stroke. At least, um, as long as you don't pass out, let me wake you up now, because you're gonna yeah, seek safe temperature. So you're gonna go over here and you're gonna cool down a little bit. I could put coolers or I could put uh, vents into their bedrooms, but I don't think that's like the way to go. How's your heat stroke? You're fine. Initial levels. That's gonna be okay. So you're just gonna go heat stroke minor. Good, 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 good. Just burn off the heat stroke. You're gonna be fine. How's the caravan? They're okay. Nothing to worry about here. So everything will get a lot better when we get a turret, because we'll just park a turret right out here, and it's just gonna murder anything that comes nearby. Sound of carnage. Just in the background, a whole caravan died. No, they're fine. I don't think any of them have died yet. They're just clearing the room of zombies for now, which is great. If they die, a little bit of loot. I mean, mostly a lot of dead man's clothes, and unfortunately, we don't have the thing to pull it apart, which drives me bonkers. Nero's gonna try to pick up the herbs, and manages to do it without being- Oh, nope, there we go. Some interruption. How's your shooting skill? You're at a 12! There you go. Headshot. And a little bit of repairing. I think she shot the wall. Here, all the herbal medicines. It's gonna be fine. Oh, the caravan's still coming! Hi, right, dead zombie. Excellent. Are you going- I don't know where the caravan's going, but this will probably end badly for them. They're just going to make a lot of space for us, which is going to be fantastic. They're happy. Nero is doing some combat. Try not to shoot any of the caravan people, which is what you're doing. Let me move you inside, because you're just... Bad things are happening. There you go. Now you can go do whatever you wanted. I think she shot someone in the back of the head. What are you doing? Are you rearming the deadfall trap? That's fine. This is when you should build your blockade. Uh, that's actually a good point. And just get everyone to run out here and build this ASAP. I mean, we could just put a door in here, too, although the zombies do like to smash doors. It's mostly about trying to interfere with as much line of sight as possible. Let's finish one first. There you go. Um, and this is quite clear now. A bit of that. We still get some wood. Good. These guys are still fighting. I mean, we could go and trade with them, but... Oh, some things have fallen here. Um, let's strip down all these bodies. Uh, let's strip down this guy before he dies. <laughs> oh, so rude. Um, um, unforbid. Oh, excellent. We can go and haul that in after. Get that built up. We got some wood there. We still get wood in our base. Good. Mm -hmm. so yeah, I mean, we'll probably end up doing some like actual doors or something over here at some point, but yeah, a few more line of sight blockers is going to do real well for us. Dirty mid-maxer. <laughs> uh, you still have to worry about burying people. Yeah, and I mean, we definitely will. Um, I wonder if I just rebuild the graves on the other side here. People will want to come out and pray at some of the graves, so we'll maybe want some that aren't too far away. Because otherwise, our people will just keep going out of the base. Here, we'll go and we'll go and set them up here. Excellent. 
build these bad boys up. That wall's done. So yeah, let's sneak in another one here. This is great. Every time the caravans show up, we can get so much done. There you go. Something like that. They can still get around, but they can't see us from a million miles away and decide to chase us. Our own people won't aggro quite as badly from them seeing stuff either. Gives us a little bit of space to do some internal mining as well. Yeah, it's going to be swell. Oh. <laughs> oh, these people are going to be so mad. We're going to make so many enemies because they keep showing up and dying. And they're like, I don't understand. You people, we keep dying whenever we visit you. And they're like, yeah, well, zombies, man. That's the way it goes. We could um, we could set up a little trap grid in some of these places, too. And that's actually almost certainly the way to go, right? It's like, let's say we did this. Uh, it starts to eat into a fair bit of min uh, materials. We might just want some wooden deadfall traps over here to save stuff, but we could do some of that. Same thing here. Just do a little bit of something like this. Again, minimize the, the line of sight potentials, and we'll sort things out afterwards. Um, and order. Chop wood, because there's no zombies over here right now, right? So let's chop the wood over here while there is some space. These guys are trying to leave the map. Zombies! Oh, white! What's going to happen, buddy? Oh, he fell down. I don't think we're going to go and do anything with him. He's too close to too many zombies. Oh my god, all these people are down. Hey, uh, Kravak. Do, 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 do. It's, it's every pawn for himself. We could be rescuing these people. We could be building up relationships. Nope. <laughs> do people turn into zombies after that? We don't know yet. We don't know. Alright. Go to bed. Are you just, uh, you're meditating? Yeah, that's fine. We will be building another bed here for potential prisoners or medical or something. May as well queue it up now. There's one way to find out. Yeah, we'll find out at some point what happens to these people. Unforbid the dead corpses. If they can be buried. We'll have to build, yeah, we're gonna have to get a crematorium set up really early. Oh, that wasn't even a haul? You were just picking up a meal from out there? What, Twinkies aren't good enough for you anymore? Well, you know, after that many Twinkies, I'd probably be sick of it, too. So I understand. Alright, a lot of the defensive structure is up now. Um, we don't want to chop those trees anymore, because they're a little bit too far. We will need some more wood soon, so we'll go ahead and grab the trees that are in the safe zone for now. We should probably set up a tree farm inside of our base. It can be in here, though, because this is semi our base at this point. And this is probably where we're going to set up the guns and things. Yeah, tree farm right over here makes a lot of sense. Don't it? It do. It do. Do is the opposite of don't. The more you know. Um, something like that. And plant some oak trees. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling that RimWorld gives Quillotine some unnatural pleasure. Totally natural. I don't know what you're talking about. Blood for the blood god. Roaming around. Hey, Nero. I'm going to go and eat some pemmican. Uh, mostly you're going to go out there and do a lot of shooting. Um, run away. There you go. Like, I'd rather you just hauled. I think survival meals have one of the lowest, and Twinkies are just survival meals here, one of the lowest priorities for being eaten because they do have a, like, a really good duration. I think that's part of what's going on there. That's why they keep prioritizing the pemmican. Which is kind of fair. Um, hey, you did it without getting attacked. That's great. Good for you. Nope, oh, zombie coming in here, so you're going to shoot it at some point. I don't like your positioning here, because bad things could happen. There you go. Good stuff. 
surprised no one's noticed this zombie yet. Come over here. Thank you. All right. Yeah, see if you can haul this stuff in there. We'll unforbid this body so they can get buried instead of rotting. And this one over here, too. But yeah, we're going to have to find a place to build our mass graves. Look at the blood. Good job. Kill. Kill. Good. Excellent. Yeah, we're going to try to hold all this stuff in, but it's not going to be easy. Dun, 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 dun. Can you eat the zombies? No, the zombies uh, decompose really, really, really fast. So there's no eating of zombies. You're going to have amazing shooting skill in no time? Yeah. I mean, like, I normally, I've got a mod where I've got, like, joy... I don't have any joist things, I just realized, that we can put down some shooting targets here. Um, but I don't think that's going to be required at all. I think we're gonna get um, we're gonna get plenty of skill doing other bits, and if we can get them some real weapons, it's gonna be fantastic. That'll probably have to wait until we get a comms console because I'm not convinced that we're gonna get much in the way of decent trade caravans that survive. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the graves out here. Although that might be that might be considered closer to the base than that, some people might want to go. And I don't know. Let, let's just go ahead and do it. It's fine. We can always enclose this later. We can keep growing our base walls. That's probably what's going to happen, actually. Dig, 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 dig. These are not sarcophagi. These are graves. I didn't hit the sarcophagi bed. There is a sarcophagi button, but I didn't hit it. Bang, bang, bang. Headshot. Heat wave is over. Well, thank frickin' frick. Because that was going to be challenging. Yeah, plant these trees. That's going to be really handy. Thought about getting the mass graves mod? Oh, I didn't know there was one. I mean, I guess that would make some sense. Oh, we could have stripped you. It's fine, but that would have all been dead man's clothing, so. No, it's okay. Are you, are you forbidden this corpse? Yeah, let's unforbid you. Plant those trees. Haul stuff in. Excellent. Mine and break risk. It's Nero again! Still a little hot. Hideous environment. Yeah, there is a lot of blood. I mean, we might actually have to get, like, the cleaning priorities a lot higher for people. Because there's going to be a lot of blood and it's going to be pretty miserable. I mean, we'll never clean it all up, but at the same time... We have to try, I think. Kill the deer. Is there a deer nearby? Oh, there's a turkey over here. We can go and hunt that one. Oh, we don't have any... Uh, we don't have a butcher's table. Although... We'll get one set up. Okay, everyone's sleeping. Do we have robots? I have the robots mod. I don't have any in here, but this might get a little crowded, but we can expand our storage later. It's a lot of deer, but I think hunting out here would be inconvenient. If anything wanders into our base, then it becomes a prime target for it. We're running low on Twinkies. How are potatoes coming along? 55% grown. We're getting there. We have 33 meals right now, so we're still okay. Cleaning up the abattoir of filth would be a very good idea. <laughs> oh, what a way to say it. Love it. Um, we got a tip in from Lone Black Fan Gaming. Thank you very much. Uh, here is 250 for the whiskey and chocolate fund. Well, thank you very much for the contribution to the whiskey and chocolate fund. We'll be uh, we'll be breaking some of that out. By the way, the multiplayer for today is going to be League of Legends ARAMs. So do make sure that your League of Legends client is all patched up. does tend to take a while if you haven't done it in a bit. Um, and we will be uh, murdering each other in there while I uh, get assistance from a little bit of beverage to make everything go, you know, better. Sure, or something. Don't shoot Kravik in the back of the head accidentally. Thank you. 
It's annoying. We do get a little bit of a mood, negative mood lift from seeing a dead body over here. But, I mean, I guess that's it. Or people are going to be miserable all the time. They're surrounded by zombies. What can you expect? Nero, where are you going? Why are you going there? Oh, you're hunting the turkey. Well, the turkey's wandered into an inconvenient area, so I might get you to stop doing that. Also, run away from the zombie. Don't get meleeed. Shotgun! Excellent. Good stuff. Colonist needs treatment. Ah! You've been bitten. You're gonna be fine. Alright, repair the walls, run over there. You're gonna go and get some medical rest. That's going to be fine. We've got the extra bed in case we do get someone to come in here. We've got tree planting. That'll happen at some point. Alright. Listen, Kravek, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna take down your clean. The grow is still pretty important. There you go. We'll get you back on research. We've got barely any made. But you got passion for it at least, so. Eventually. But yeah, you get you gotta plant the trees. That's that's very important that things get planted. And also doctoring. That's your that's your lover. But definitely make sure to go and treat them. Be cool if the zombie colonists could zombie fight. Could still happen, I don't know. I have no idea. Zombies taught me anything except being bitten by a zombie means you'll be fine. Yeah, exactly. Nothing bad ever happened. I mean, it looks like nothing happens by itself. I don't know if it spreads zombieism. There are, like, a couple of different zombie mods for uh, RimWorld, so there's a couple of different ways to try it. I like this one just because... I wanted to try this one because of the sheer amount of zombies that were going to be involved. Uh, I'm not sure how well this is going to work out. I think we got to get everyone out there en masse. Let's thin this area out a wee bit. So that you can do some hauling. You got to purge. got to purge, Marty. Oh, this one's decided to chase us in here. Like, it keeps being Ashy who somehow gets, like, in a position where they have to solo some zombies. Yeah, haul some stuff. It's a lot of pemmican. That's actually going to be really good for our meals. Hooray for dead tribals. Should bump up the zombies. Uh, I think we're doing fine zombie-wise. And again, if we don't keep killing them, they do just keep spawning. They'll reach up to a thousand. So it is going to get kind of on the ridiculous side. See, Ashi again is going to get himself in a whole bunch of trouble. Unless we babysit. Ah! Run, 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 run. Shoot it! Okay, there. Look, this is the zombie. It's clearly going for us. It's trying to get us through the wall. Okay. Oh man, we gotta get turrets. Oh man, we gotta get turrets. Da -da -da -da. You should download basic bridges that allows you to fish. Um, I do have the fishing stuff in. Um, don't know. Yeah, fishing pier. We could go f do some fishing in here. That's actually not a bad way to get some food going. Is it the other way around? Maybe it's the other way around. No, no, because that's the standing spot. On mud? I think because it's not a proper lake or something. Oh, there we go. There's a spot. Okay, so that one's no good. But this one is. Take a lot of wood... Is this mud? Oh, it is mud. Okay, I see. Oh, so you can't normally build on mud. That's why you gotta use the other one over here. Um, there might be another spot to do it, but 